Okay, hello again, y'all. This is uh, Ron One and Mad Mikey. Hi! <laughs> uh, we just got done filming an Iraqi veteran 8888 uh, man can opening, the July man can. And uh, when that started, I challenged my bro here to a pocket dump because he did one on me a while back when I was coming over to do some editing. He surprised me as soon as I walked in and we did one. So I told him I was going to catch him someday. So this is it. Out. So, start dumping, bro. Okay, well, see what you got. Over here. He usually is pretty well equipped. Here's my EEC light. What is it? It's a Night Core. Uh, the model number is MH20GT. Takes a 18650 battery. How many luminaries? Oh, heck, I don't know. It's there. Most of them I got lately are close, right around 1,000 lumens. Okay. Uh -huh. Not bad that's size. Uh, yeah, that's about as big as I'd want to carry in my pocket. Yep. It's got the clip on it and everything. Nice flashlight, I like it. Then, what we got here? Oh, this is, if you've seen my reviews of the the uh, Pataka mag cases, which I love, I bought their wallet. I haven't done a review on it yet. A wallet? Yeah. Huh. Um, I'm not too crazy about it, and you'll have to check the review for why. I'll it's explain. The size of but a deck of cards. Yeah, it kind of fans out. You can see everything. And this is the UV model if you've got cards that have a magnetic strip, which I think is part of the reason why I don't like it. But I'll explain in the review. So that blocks people from stealing your info? Yeah. The credit cards go on this section here. And, and does and, it uh, have a uh, place for money, for bills? Yeah. That's the other thing that's not the greatest. Where did I put it? Or maybe I took that off? Oh, well. oh no, there it is. Oh, Got a little clip clippy. there. You can't put a whole lot of money in it, but that's that's part. But you'll have to check the review. Yeah. So it's not too hot on it yet, but he'll be doing a full review on it soon. So. What else do I got? Come on now, this isn't a full length motion picture. Got my picture. Uh, iPhone X, of course. Oh, whoopee dang. Yeah. Got to have a cell phone. Yeah. And let's see, I think that's all on that side. Over here, I usually keep two knives. This is an um, mm -hmm. uh, Razor Light EDC from Outdoor Edge. I like this. Is that got this the is... changeable blades? Yes, it oh. does. The blades easily come off without any tools. I can press this button here, take the blade right off. Huh. And pretty cool. And you have to line it so up. So always sharp, eh? Yeah, and I do sharpen them because I'm cheap. Really? But I like it. It's my box cutter. Very light. Ooh, wow! Wait, I've had it a while. It? Yeah. Who makes it now? Outer Edge. Outdoor edge. edge, I think it is. Oh, that edge. doesn't weigh anything. Yeah, you cool. close that up because you don't want to cut your finger off. Me? But yeah, I like it. I, I didn't know how well this would wear. It's got a plastic clip, plastic scales, but I've had this probably about a year. And I carry it every day, use it all the time for opening boxes, and it's held up great. So. Cool. And it's only about, I think, about $25. Uh, then I usually carry a secondary knife. Today I've got the Spider Co. Which I used to open the Iraqi. This is the Spyderco Dialects. I think it's made by this Russian guy of Dialects, the Junior. He died of Lex. Yeah. I, I, this is my like food processing knife. I love this. For yeah. He, oh, he's oh he cooks so much too. I know. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh -huh. that, that's a nice knife. It was not a cheap knife. I think it was around two hundred dollars. Yeah. I don't think there is Spyderco. Spyderco is a good knife. It's never a cheap knife. Uh, let's see what else have I got in here. And he wears these almost every day. He wears oh, yeah. these Duluth Trading Company pants that are great pants for pockets and wear. So check them out, DuluthTradingCompany.com. They don't sponsor us or anything. We're both just big fans of most all of their clothing. Okay, and this is just a cleaning cloth for my sunglasses. I wear a contact. I have a contact lens case. In case it burns, you need to take it off. I have a Gerber dime, a little multi tool. Which you can tell by the wear, I carry all the time. Yeah, I love those. Got pliers, knife, all that little stuff. Great, Very small, handy tool. Uh, multi tool. Eye drops, because my weak part is my eyes. I need to have drops. So 
So I was here drops, and this is an emergency fire starter. No, I don't smoke. And you see how well this is worn too. I carry this all the time. First click, look at that. You can actually solder with that. Is that liquid? Uh, yeah. Butane. Or yeah. Something? I like it. It's Pretty cool. You can see the level of butane there. And it worked breath. first shot. Worked first shot. Love it. And what else do we got? Oh, my keys here. Jeez. Jeez. Here we go. Holy crap. My keys. This is a. Man, this is wild. A key bar. It holds most of my keys. Good. It would hold more, but there's reasons I hook on it. But anyway, you flip it out. It's kind of like a pocket knife. Turns your keys into like a pocket knife. And they come with extra size screws and washers so you can stack as many as you want. The scales just screw apart and they come apart and you can stack up as many keys as you want. These keys were for some special locks I took on a trip I just got back from. I'll probably take those off. And I keep, this is a key, I believe, to my spare tire on the truck. We don't care. Yeah, I know. Yeah. And my fob for my truck. So, key. You're the one who wanted me to do a pocket dump. Yeah, so I want, yeah. You can get the good with the bad. Just don't pull your rubbers out. All right, that gets all there. Then, of course, there's, here I've got a, my multi-tool. Holy. This is the Swiss Champ, I believe. Holy it's the biggest one they got. Crap. It's got virtually everything on here. Yeah, just list what don't have. Don't have a gun on it. That's about it. No. <laughs> don't have a gun on it. But some of the things I really like that really come in handy sometimes are, see, where are they now? Oh, right here. Here's There's a toothpick. Which my, my favorite. My brother, it's one of his favorite tools on a oh, knife. Oh, yeah. Right here is a ballpoint pen Whoa. in an emergency you Fixed always have something to write an with. essay in an emergency you know. and over here's a little slide into it's a little pair of tweezers great for taking out splinters and stuff Whoa. Okay. so love that corkscrew and first time I got it this little corkscrew I go I don't know if you can see it on the camera but there's this little gray thing in between the corkscrews I thought what the heck is that Let's for see. what the heck is that for that you unscrew it and it's a little tiny screwdriver like for doing glasses and stuff. Ah be damn. Pretty trick, huh? Yeah. Huh. You just screw That's it in clever. there. You probably almost threw it away. Yeah, I didn't know what it was. So anyway, cool. love that. That's pretty neat. Then I got spare mag. Spare mag for 45 what? caliber ACP. Extended mag. Ooh, that's some pretty awesome looking little bullets in there. Yeah, R.I.P. And this, of course, is loaded, so don't panic. This is an XDS-45. Um, okay. See that? Aiming at you, you Nice scared? gun. Nice gun. It's very small for a 45. Yeah, it is. And then the holster, if you can see it, and we'll pull in a close-up of it. This is made by Simply Rugged. It's a leather from a blue wildebeest from Africa. Whoa, that's a beautiful holster. He had done a holster for some kind of promotion at Bucky's, uh, Bucky O'Neill Guns, our favorite gun store. And he used that leather. And when I saw it, I go, oh my God, that's the most beautiful leather I ever saw. Can you make a holster from an XDS out of that? He said, yeah. He said he thinks he had enough. So he did. And I love it. SimplyRugged.com. SimplyRugged.com. If you like leather holsters, he's got it. The only thing I think I got left is in my back pocket here. Uh oh. Look on. Oh jeez. Keep myself beautiful. That's not working. <laughs> hey, we're gonna do it. <laughs> that's it, folks. So that's it. I think you got every area covered, like night. Yeah, for sure. And some three and four times over. Not bad, bro. You pass. He gets an A. Woo! -hoo. Thank you. Thanks. Bye. Bye, everybody.